Lower. All right, can you, you hear me? We can hear yeah. you. Hi, hi. Hey there. Hi, I haven't shared in a while, but I thought since uh, Freddie shares, I got to share once in a while. And uh, he's on day 87, I'm on day 86. So I thought it's about time. And um, let's see. I'm going to be out of town. I'm out of town right now. So finishing up the 88 days out of town is a really cool challenge. And um, I thought yesterday was fun flying from New Mexico to uh, Traverse City, Michigan was a really neat challenge because it made me realize, you know, you can do your 160 ounces of water when you're when you're flying, even when they say, Hey, there's a lot of turbulence in the air and people next to me, the poor lady. Oh, I don't want to tell you what happened because people are having dinner right now. <laughs> but, um, you know, I was, yeah, that was, that was from Albuquerque to Denver. And it was like, are you kidding me? You can't even hand me some paper towels. I'm in the back row. Can you help us out here? Nope. We got to wait till we stop the plane. So, you know, they have a hard job, so I shouldn't give them a hard time, but it was pretty rough, um, but it didn't stop me from getting off the plane and having my small meal. <laughs> uh, so I stayed on track with my hard boiled eggs. You know, you just got to pack your stuff. You're, everybody knows by now, just bring those cheese, eggs, protein bars, um, portable blenders, whatever you need. But um, it was really fun because I got on the plane and I'm like, uh, I needed some salt. So I said, hey, can you just give me a bottle of water so I don't pass out? And they handed me a big bottle of water. You know, there's little tips there, you guys keep hydrated. Uh, I went through turning, saying, hey, uh, I know there's turbulence, but I got to use the bathroom now. So if you got to drink your water, there's ways to do it. They'll let you get up and use the plane restroom. But anyway, I just wanted to say that because it was it was a fun day traveling and I, you know, stayed really hydrated and and I did my uh, walk in the airport. I didn't do my shuffle and I was kind of concerned because walking on the treadmill for the I haven't done it because I've been doing the shuffle now for the whole 60 minutes. Walking gives me a little neuropathy when I look down. I feel a little tingling, but shuffling doesn't. So that's a, a, a great realization that shuffling is definitely healthier for me. Walking through the airport, I was feeling the tingling in my legs and my back, you know, when I did that hour and a half walk. But you have luggage and you're carrying all that stuff. So that doesn't help but I found it really interesting. Um, it was the first time today I shuffled outdoors instead of doing it on the um, rebounder. My internet connection says I'm stable. Can you hear me? You're good. So the You're rebounder good. is always great to shuffle. Okay. The rebounder I found really great when I didn't get to get on my uh, treadmill, but I got to shuffle outside in Michigan today for a full hour. And um, I got to just kind of shuffle in place a lot because my sister Amy is having hip surgery tomorrow. And uh, my heart goes out to her because she's my age. And this is number two. So um, I'm just counting my blessings. This is a really great protocol and I love you guys. I'm getting emotional because it's okay. I was just thinking about the videos and I have watched every one of the videos. And Chelsea, you mentioned your grandmother and I love the video. If you guys getting married, it's it was like absolutely really touching. That's my favorite video so far and they're all good let's see what else did i want to talk about oh i know one thing that's kind of uh really good everything my numbers were really good on, on day 60 except i went from age 58 to 59 so i want to say some people get older sometimes <laughs> 
Jeff, do you have an answer for me there? Because um, I know well, it's just a well, really well, silly well, thing. To no, it. well, actually, I do. So, so realize that the there's a little bit of an anomaly, and that's that's about one in a, a hundred people. But it's actually it's a good thing if you look and see what happened. Is well, let me ask you a question first, because this will answer it. What happened to your visceral fat? Uh, let's see. Look it up real quick here. I think it went. Oh, okay. My visceral fat went down from. It started off and it started off at three, and it went down to two. So, and then it's it stayed at two. Okay, so two is super super healthy, yeah. but but see, I knew that's what you were gonna say. Okay. Because there's an anomaly when yeah. people get in that ultra low visceral fat, for some reason, that device reads that as, you know, like it's a, a super lean elderly person and it adds age to it every time. <laughs> but the good news is you- I thought so. But, but you have to be like a two or a three for Which that to- very rare. Which, which is super, super rare, by the way. I mean, that's like as low as you can get and still be alive. <laughs> so that's spectacular. So that's a good problem. It can only happen in that situation. So, so trust me. Yeah. You'd rather have a two visceral fat. If that thing said you're 80, I'd say be it a two visceral fat. Cause that's, that's the anomaly. It just doesn't comprehend. Okay. It doesn't comprehend that a normal age person could be that low on a visceral fat. And so that's why it thinks, you know, it's almost like it's a program, uh, you know, mess up. It's a program bug. Like they, they just didn't program it right to realize that someone could actually be that lean on their visceral fat and still be young. That they thought that's only elderly people. Because that's the only time I've ever seen that is if somebody has a two or a three on their visceral fat. By the way, okay. I'd trade. If I could have a two or a three on my visceral fat, I'd be happy to be 80 yeah. on that thing. <laughs> and yeah, you know, my, my, I was born in 59, like you were, John, and to be it's 62 and say it says 59, there's nothing wrong with that, right? So it shouldn't cry over a little bit of a, I mean, you know, so what, I got a, a year older. <laughs> hey, well, um, well, and actually you, you really didn't. It, it just happens to be a device. No. It happens to be a device reading. So, but you know, you look yeah. spectacular. You look yeah, like you're 40 like years you're, old. I was going to say, I would have you thought like, you were in your 40s. Yeah, you look like you're 40 years old. You look spectacular. Yeah, yeah you do. Oh, you guys, thank you. That's really sweet. But um, yeah, I've, I don't, I definitely don't feel 62. It's, it's been wonderful. Um, one thing I realized that when I feel a little off, I wanted to share this with everybody that might feel a little off, like, oh, you know, I need to eat something and, you know, avocado always helps me. But what really helps is if I just, oh, I haven't done my salt. That really is a big one for me, you know, to make sure, did I do my salt? Have I taken some potassium? Have I, you know, had, you know, I just drink so much water that I need more than a teaspoon of salt every day. Yep. Is what yeah, good for I you. Yeah. Good for you. Alisa, Alyssa well, told me. Well, and Wendy, I'm, yeah. I'm serious. When you're done, please do a Please do a little I'm two minute sure. testimony, <laughs> testimony video. Cause girl, you are a poster child. <laughs> yeah. People are putting in the chat. You look like oh. you're 40 years old. <laughs> yeah. I'm not, the, we're not the only one to think you look 40 years old. They're putting it in the chat. You look 40 years old. <laughs> so, yeah. um, that's a, thank you everybody. That's a, no sleep last night, getting yeah. in late to Traverse city. And my, my, I still need to keep on this. You know, the maintenance program will be great because my water is 50, 53.9 and I, it should be 55, right? Wait. Oh, okay. 53.9. That's almost 55. Yeah, you're almost it's getting one there, point right? Away. You're just one point away from perfection. That's awesome. It's going to get there, right? Just keep, 
keep doing what I'm doing and get on yep. the maintenance and yeah, it is. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah it it's is. all good. It's been really wonderful. Thanks, guys. Love you. No, we well, we love we love you, and I I'm I am very excited for yes. your for your final testimony video because you're going to inspire a lot of people. They're going to say, if I can look like that at 62, sign me up. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, and, and a shout out to you too, because this is really important. You guys, we have a lot of people that travel. So just the fact yeah. that you own that travel, I mean, she's doing an hour and a half walk in the airport with her luggage. She's got her meal prepped. I mean, that's like, that's perfect. Like I great job on that. Great job. Yeah. I love that. I didn't, I didn't pack the clothes I needed, but you know, you can always borrow clothes. You can't, you can't get the good nutrition in the airport. Even the juice, I tried to get the juice place, but I was like, oh, okay, bye. I got, I'm going to miss my plane if I don't get out of line and get on that airplane. So that a girl. Yeah. You yeah. just got to be prepared with your food. You guys. Great job, Wendy. Well, so we thanks. love you, girl. We love you. Yeah.